Hello there people and welcome to another episode of Montmartre TV. If you remember a little while ago, I painted this abstract landscape and because I had so much fun painting it, I thought that I might paint another one in a similar style, but with a city theme. I think these would be great companion paintings and I think they'd look really great in the same room. So let's get into it. So for art supplies, we're going to use a plastic brush washer. We'll also be using the Dimension paint in the 250ml tubs and I'll be using a 50ml wide Artist Taclon brush and a number 12 angle. The canvas that I'll be using is a 36 inch by 48 inch or 91 by 121 centimetre double thick canvas. So first I tint the canvas with a mix of orange and permanent red. I dip my brush directly into the tubs and evenly distribute them with a damp brush. I then lay the edge of the buildings in with a number 12 angle. When I do this you'll notice that I taper the buildings a little bit. Do exaggerate and force the perspective. At this stage there's not much point putting lots of detail in but I do want to establish the position of the main elements, like the shop fronts and the road. These shapes here will hopefully look like lights from traffic. I then switch back to my 50mm wide artist Taclon and block in areas and reinforce the angles. For the sky I plunge my brush into a tub of purple and lay it across the top of the canvas between my buildings. Into this I lay in blocks of ultramarine blue, but I am mindful not to overpower the purple, as she must remain dominant. As I move down the canvas I slowly add white to create a mauve in that lower portion of sky. I can create the clouds with blocks of that ultramarine. I make the clouds smaller as I move down the canvas. Next I revert back to the number 12 and add bits of white. These will be my city's lights. I place them wherever I feel there should be a burst of colour. As I lay this base in, I keep the angled force perspective in mind. Over that white I lay in lemon yellow, and then permanent red. As I lay in my top coat, the detail of each sign can just be described with a series of strokes. That is enough to get the message across. A painting in this style would gain nothing more if I were to meticulously render each sign exactly. The impression is all the viewer needs. Next I add the blue, in this case the ultramarine, and again just balance it out. Finally I add some monostrel green, here and there, I stand back, appraise my work, and the last step will be a refining touch of lamp black. Wow, that turned out brilliantly. I'm really stoked with how it looks, and it was a lot of fun as well. And if you do like painting in this style of artwork, then make sure you check out our abstract landscape. And you can find that at montmart.net. While you're there, check out the other great lessons too. We've also got our Facebook attached to that, and our blog, and our family feed as well. And if you subscribe to that, then you can get free hints and tips to help you with your art. So remember to keep on painting. Thank you.